Hi guys. Well Welcome. So I hope you are enjoying the video. Uh, so in case you want to embark on such a project or in case you have you are having a building and you are left with a brass train, you don't know what to do, you want people to do it for you, don't worry. You can send us a private message and we will be able to get you the, to the right people who, who will be able to help you to do your work. In case you have any questions, any feedback, any queries also do not hesitate to access and we will be more than happy to answer you so coming back to the classroom as you said it will be very advisable for you to do any chiseling job before the main classroom the reason behind it is that uh, you will save a lot of time you will save a lot of resources you know because uh, when you finish the brass train and you go and do any chisel job, that means you need to go back and do the redressing. That means you are you are going to hire people to do the job. You are going to buy materials, and it's going to be a double price, you know. So it is always advisable to do any chiseling job before 
you do the final plus screen so as i said guys don't don't forget to subscribe to our youtube channel share this video with your friends with your families and also with anyone who wants to embark on such a project so as the video is going on just sit back and enjoy the rest of the video As we all know, the plastering phase is very important phase in our project and for this reason the type of materials you use in doing this kind of uh, plastering also contribute a lot to the beauty of your building. So it is always also advisable uh, when choosing the sand for the plastering to choose the smooth fine one so that um, your building will be you know will be very nice to look from external and um, when it's time for the painting you know because the plastering um, because you use a quality sand or let's say you, because you use the appropriate sand for the plastering you could see the beauty of your building you know we have different types of the sand so it is very important to ask and get the right one um, for the plastering, we hope we are giving you the necessary information so that whenever um, you get to this stage, it will be very useful to you for you to know what to do. So, hey guys, as I said before, um, don't forget to subscribe to, to our YouTube channel, share this video with your friends, with anyone who wants to embark on such a project, and also if you have any queries any any queries anything don't say no this is not necessary or this is unnecessary feel free please just ask anything you want us uh anything you want to ask and uh, we are here to answer you you know we've been through this so we might get some little experience to share with you to help you with your projects or with anything that you are about to do or even if you are undoing it and i said before if you want people to help you to do all this uh, all this kind of um project also inbox me and i'll get you to the right people so thank you very much uh, for staying in tune 
to watch this video subscribe so that you'll be among the first people to watch our new videos so thank you very much and meet you or see you on our next video bye bye